Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in case you follow me on Instagram already, then you probably know I have a huge giveaway going on. So this is my Christmas and New Year giveaway for all of my subscribers. And I'm giving away a 10,000 rupees worth of gift voucher from my house. So you can go ahead and splurge and get anything that you want for 10,000 rupees. So in case you're interested in participating in that giveaway, then you can go ahead and check out my Instagram handle, which will be right here. So in this video, I wanted to share some of my most favorite and loved products from Nykaa.com. Now, without any further ado, let's get started. So starting off with foundations, at the moment, I have three favorites from Nykaa, and two of these are my all-time favorites. That is the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. This is is like the most full coverage foundation out there and it's also a very very long lasting foundation the next one is the l'oreal infallible foundation and this one gives your skin the most beautiful finish and i think this is the most favorite foundation of mine i think i've gone through about three or four bottles of this so this is like my holy grail foundation and i've also been currently enjoying the nyx total control drop foundation so it's really nice how you can just drop the foundation on your face and this one is very very thin and consistency and it blends out wonderfully and talking about foundations I have a foundation brush which I had to mention in this video because I absolutely love it this is the NYX professional makeup brush and it doesn't have a name I think it's called the foundation brush and normally I'm a big fan of using foundations with my beauty sponge uh, like a beauty blender but with this brush it just makes the job of blending the foundation super super easy and very quick so next i've got two face powders with me that i really love both of these are loose powders uh, the first one here is called the natio um, translucent powder and it's a really amazing setting powder like i really love using this i use this for baking for setting the makeup and it does the job wonderfully and this is also a very good dupe for the laura mercier translucent powder i had that one before but after that i started using this and this is equally good it's really really good um the next one i've got is the makeup revolution luxury powder and this one is in the shade banana so this is very similar to the banana powder by ben nye this one is slightly more yellow and uh, it has more color than the banana powder but it looks really nice on the skin like don't let the color fool you like it looks very yellow on the pan but when you apply it to the face it actually looks very very brightening and it's a really good um, powder for setting your under eye and if you have yellow toned skin then this one would be a really good um, powder for you next I have two primer favorites from Nykaa and this one is an eyeshadow primer it's called the MAC paint pot so they come in a number of different colors the one I've got here is in the shade painterly but I also have this one in soft ochre uh, so this one is an amazing eyeshadow primer it just sticks to your eyes and it won't budge the entire day for the face I've got uh, this uh, primer by NYX and it's called Soft Focus Tinted Primer and it's a very silicone sort of a primer so it just smooths out your skin tone beautifully it fills up your pores and it just blurs out any fine lines that you might have and it also has this tint to it so you can also use this on its own uh, especially on days when I feel lazy to go ahead and do the whole foundation contouring thing I just go ahead and use this and it just makes my skin appear very very smooth and very flawless moving on to concealers I have two favorites from Maybelline and this one is the instant age rewind like uh, this one is a full coverage concealer and it's one of the best concealers out there and the other one is a Maybelline fit me concealer both of these are my absolute holy grail products this one is slightly more um, dewy and it's not very drying this can be a little bit drying at times so I enjoy using this during the summers and this during the winters next up I've got two facial sprays the first one here is by L'Oreal and it's called Infallible Pro Spray and Set. So this is basically a setting spray and this one has no dewiness to it. It's great if you are someone who wants that matte looking finish. It's a very good uh, makeup setting spray. It makes your makeup last so much more longer. And this is the second bottle uh, and this one is also almost over. So you can tell how much I love this. Next is the uh, MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus Spray. And I think this is like my third or fourth bottle of this. I've been using this from a very, very long time. I absolutely love 
the spray that it comes with. It like gives off this very fine mist and this kind of takes away the powderiness from your face and it gives your face that very hydrated and you know dewy sort of an effect. So I really love using the spray especially during the winter time and especially when I feel like I've got too much powder on and I want to remove the powderiness from my skin. So next I've got this brow product that I've been absolutely loving and using almost every single day over the past one or two months and this is the Milani Stay Put Brow Color. So this is basically a brow cream product, it's a brow pomade and it comes with this dual ended brush which has a flat um, angled brush on one side and a spoolie on the other and this brush is so amazing like it applies the product beautifully um, and also this uh, pomade itself is very very similar to the Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, Dip Bar Pomade. I think this one is also equally good. I absolutely love it. Like I always used to do my eyebrows using like brow powders but after using this product I'm like never going back to powders again like I absolutely love this. So next I've got a new launch by Sugar and this one is the um, Contour D-Force Face Palette. So these basically come with three products inside. You have a contouring powder, a highlighter and a blush. And the highlighter is like the star of the show for me. The highlighter of these palettes are absolutely gorgeous. They are so beautiful. They give you that most amazing glow. I've been using these highlighters like almost every single day. And also the contouring powder is amazing. Like it blends out beautifully it's not patchy or anything next i've got the nyx blush palette and the one i've got is in the shade sweet cheeks and as you can see it comes with eight blushers in one palette so it's a very very compact palette and you're getting such an amazing amount of product and you also have like very good shades in there like I think most of the shades would suit a lot of skin tones out there and also these two shades are uh, the first two shades have shimmer in them so you can also use them as a highlighter and I think once you've got this palette then you wouldn't need to buy another blush so yeah I think uh, this is totally worth giving a try so next up I've got this eye cream which I've been absolutely loving lately and this one is the Kiehl's powerful wrinkle reducing eye cream um, I was using their avocado eye cream before and even that was really good but right now it's winter and my skin has started to get pretty dry so I felt like I needed more moisture uh, especially under my eyes this is quite expensive uh, like 3200 rupees um, but it definitely does the work and it's a very very nourishing under eye cream so in case you have a very very dry under eye or you have fine lines under your eyes then you should definitely give this one a go so the winter is also the only time when I actually take care of my body like I moisturize my body in the summers I'm too lazy to apply any sort of body cream or anything so I've got two favorites at the moment and um, I actually prefer using oils over body creams because I feel oils they absorb it much more faster and they are much more lighter than lotions and uh, body butters so um, the skin oil that I've really been enjoying is uh, this one this is by Palmer's and it's called their coca butter formula and what I do is straight after my shower I go ahead and uh, apply this oil when my skin is still moist I feel like it makes my skin so smooth and you know it's just like moisturizes my skin and it just feels really really nice and soft. The next body oil is by The Body Shop and it's called Honey Bronze Shimmering Dry Oil. So this one is basically a bronzing oil so it's not going to make your skin look absolutely dark or anything but it gives that very nice bronzy sort of glow to the skin so that's the reason why I absolutely love using this on my legs especially now it's like a festive season so when I'm going out when I'm wearing a dress and somehow I feel since it has a bronzing effect it also kind of makes my legs look slimmer and much more toned down so yeah I absolutely love using this um during parties and when I'm wearing like short dresses and showing off my legs but I hate how this smells like it smells so bad it smells like theocarpine oil but luckily it does not last for too long my next favorite item from Nykaa has got to be the Batiste dry shampoo I've used so many dry shampoos out there but I think this one is one of the best dry shampoos out there. I really like the original version of it. I love how this smells. It's like very, very fresh. Uh, whereas this one has a fruity, um, 
floral sort of a scent. Uh, not a big fan of the scent, but it's like okay, I can work with it. But there's another one which um, comes with leopard print in it. That one I really don't like. I got that one as well, but I haven't used it because I hate how it smells. But other than that, they keep your hair matte and they soak up all the oils and the effects also last for quite a long time. Another item for the hair is my Tangle Teaser. So this is basically a hairbrush for those of you who don't know um, and why I love this is because my hair is super super fine so it gets tangled very easily. If I use a normal comb then I end up breaking a lot of my hair and it's very very difficult but with this one it's like tangle free. Look at that. It just goes through your hair so smoothly even if you have like the biggest bunch of tangles in your hair. It does not tug or pull on your hair and it like very efficiently um, untangles uh, your hair. So that's what I absolutely love about this. Um, if you have uh, fine hair and if you have hair that tangles very easily then you have to get yourself a tangle teaser because this one is the bomb for tangled hair. I have got a sunscreen spray and this one is by L'Oreal. So this is the UV Perfect Aqua Essence Sunscreen Mist. And why I really love this is because it's the most convenient way of touching up your sunscreen throughout the day. Especially for us, those who wear makeup, it's not possible to, you know, touch up um, your face with sunscreen. But with this one, it makes the job so easy. It's transparent. So this is one of my must-haves in my handbag. And I think this is like my fourth or fifth tube. Like, I've been using this ever since I discovered it. Now moving on to eyeshadows. The palette that I've been using quite a lot these days is uh, this one. This is by NYX and it's called the Lid Lingerie Palette. And it's such a beautiful palette, like it's a matte palette. Like look at all those shades. They're absolutely gorgeous. It's a beautiful warm tone palette. And I've been totally loving these sort of brick tone, brown colors um, this season. The other palette by NYX that I also really like is this one. And this one is the NYX Full Throttle Palette. And this is in the shade Color Riot. So it's kind of a similar family of colors. Uh, but this one has a uh, beautiful terracotta and you know um, deep red colors it has three matte eyeshadows and one shimmery eyeshadow in it as for makeup brushes i absolutely love pack brushes like all of their brushes are very high in quality and they are very similar to the sigma brushes but they are much more cheaper and much more um, accessible and it's the same with their um, eyelashes as well so um, the eyelashes are also very high quality they look very similar to the Ardell lashes but they are super affordable these are only um, 175 rupees each and they're very natural looking they didn't look very plasticky like a lot of other local lashes as for lipstick I highly recommend the brand Sugar absolutely love their crayons their matte lipsticks and their liquid lipsticks i also really like the um pack um retro matte lip glosses they are beautiful the formula is absolutely amazing another newly launched liquid lipstick by nika that i've been really loving is the wet n wild uh, liquid cat suit matte lipsticks and i've got all the six shades and i just filmed a video on them yesterday so it'll be up after this video so stay tuned for that i'll be swatching all of the six shades i also I also really like the formula of the Lacme 9 to 5 Weightless Mousse uh, Lip and Cheek Tints. These are like the creamiest, the smoothest um, matte lipsticks out there and you can also use them as a blush. And lastly I've got the Cult Favorite and this one is by NYX and it's their Soft Matte Lip Queens. Like I have about 6 or 7 of these and I absolutely love them. They have beautiful nude shades as well as very very dark shades. And these are also not at all drying but they are a very very nice and comfortable formula to wear. Alright guys, so those were all of my top picks from Nika.com. I hope you found something helpful and something new in this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button and also subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and I will see you guys in the next one.